Hey, Graham. Asia Tech Podcast in Shanghai. We're Get on out. the Bund. Yeah, looking over at Pudong. That's 132 meters behind us. Is it really? Yeah. So I heard it was slightly shorter than the um, Tokyo Sky Tree. <laughs> three meters. Three, that's three meters shorter than the Tokyo Sky Tree. Would you believe that? Right. No, it's okay. It's a big tower. It's, it's a really big tower. It's beautiful. Hey, check this out. All this area over here, like 20 years ago, didn't exist. Weeds. Yeah. What was that? Weeds, I think. I don't remember. It's pretty exciting, though. <laughs> Alright, so we're, we're done with Shanghai, right? We are done. We spent a really great three productive days here. We were in Fukuoka for a couple of days, figuring out what a, what a great startup city that was. We went to Tokyo to get some admin done. And then we came to Shanghai for more startup and more technology stuff. I think it was a really productive week. I learned a lot. Yeah. Um, with Huawei? With Huawei. It was yeah. really great. And I'd be happy to come back and do this all over again. Looking forward, though, to the rest of the tour. Yeah, where are we going next? Well, we're planning it out. It's either Vietnam or Yangon. We'll figure it out as we go along. Vote here. Yeah, vote. Tell us where you want us to be. But we'll definitely be in one of those places great. next. So what do we want us to purpose? What are we doing? We're just trying to figure out what's the great, what makes a great startup city right. in Asia, right? right. Is it necessary to with a big skyscrapers? I know that sounds a bit facile, but... Not really. Right. Not really. It doesn't hurt to have a big uh, other business infrastructure there. Yeah. But it's not um, sufficient. Right. So what are we looking for? We want to look for building out of an ecosystem, right? Are there investors there? Right. Are there an angel seed investors there? Are there Series A investors there? Yeah. Are there other entrepreneurs to help you there? Are there entrepreneurs who've succeeded? Right. Right? Is the tech infrastructure there? Do you have access to all of the internet that you need? You have access to all the development assets that you need. You have access to mentors and advisors. And are you globally connected as well? And you need all of these things right, to be able to have a great startup ecosystem. And all of those things are equally as important. Do you have government support or is the government in the way? How does it work? What's the system that's there? If you're a foreigner, can you get a visa? Yeah. Right? All these yeah. things are really important. These things are important, but you don't often think about them when you think about startup. No. Right? No. Often people just think it's about money. Access to the money or technology. Right, so and if you're doing e-commerce, there's the logistics there. Not yeah. only can I sell the things that I have, but can I get the things that I think that I'm selling to my clients? And is that domestic? Is it international? What's the region like? And how does that impact what that city gets from the ecosystem as well? Yeah. It's all important. And it's all to help. It is. So we've really only done two cities now, and we've got a lot more to go. I think we're going to add them as we go along. Yeah. This might be endless. There's nothing wrong with having an endless tour of Asia. <laughs> cool. So we're going to sign off now because we're going to get a flight. Thank you so much for watching. Bye for now. We'll be back. Yeah. We'll see you in your city in Asia soon. Asia Tech Podcast. Take care. Michael Waits.